what is up guys it's your boy kevin or rival freestyle bringing you another freestyle football tutorial it's currently 1 37 in the morning i'm out here grinding creating this video for you guys i know it's been a while but i've just been doing my thing in this video i should be teaching you one of the easiest fundamental tricks in freestyle football around the world this is what around the world looks like Before I challenge you to try this trick, I recommend that you master these other essential freestyle skills. The basic kickups, foot stall. I created an in the tutorial on both of these freestyle skills all in my last video. Click the link in the description or click here to learn these fundamental skills. Around the world is considered a classic trick. A lot of freestylers first trick was around the world. There are several different styles of ball tricks. Around the world belongs to the lowers or lower body category of freestyle. A lot of harder lower tricks were created by adding around the world and another trick. This is why it's important for you not to skip the fundamentals if you want to reach that higher level. You can perform the around the world trick in two different ways. Around the world inside and around the world outside. Similar to being left or right footed, many freestylers also seem to have a preference in which direction they go around the ball. In this tutorial, I shall be teaching you around the world inside. The first step in learning around the world is doing it from a footstall. Get yourself in a footstall position. From a footstall position, you want to move the ball up at the same time you do the revolution. It is also important to be aware of your standing foot. Your standing foot must perform a small hop when it is halfway around the ball. This small hop helps in taking off some of the work from your strong foot, leading to less foot fatigue, especially during long around the world combos. So from a foot stop position, you do the revolution, perform a small hop halfway around the ball, all in one continuous motion. Keep the ball waist tight. One of the misunderstandings of this trick is that you need a fast foot. Don't expect to have a fast foot as a beginner. The most important thing to keep in mind when learning around the world is technique and timing. Having a fast foot does help a little before learning this trick, but your foot speed naturally improves the more you practice around the world. After feeling comfortable with around the world from a foot stop position, you want to progress. Chant yourself further by doing around the world from foot juggles. I recommend you feel comfortable doing 75 to 100 foot juggles. When touching the ball, you want to spin it by using your big toe area. Fix this common mistake to have a smoother, more stylish looking around the world. Some freestylers kick the ball up and as a second motion, go around the ball. The way to prevent this is by moving the ball up at the same time you do the revolution. When you feel comfortable doing around the world, I challenge you to try these combos. Around the world, around the world. Around the world, crossover. Around the world, weak foot. Whenever you learn around the world, make sure you record yourself doing these tricks. Send me the video on my Instagram and I'll give you a shout out on my story. I hope that you find this step-by-step -step freestyle football tutorial helpful. Come back to this video anytime you need a reference point. Please, give this video a like or a dislike and share this video with anybody who you know that needs to step their skill level up. Let's challenge each other to become better freestylers. My goal for my YouTube channel is to reach 100 subscribers. When I reach 100 subscribers, I will do a giveaway prize. The prize will either be a soccer ball, clothes, or some gift cards. Okay guys, so it is currently 2.51 a.m. in the morning. I'm really tired, I've been grinding, just trying to create this tutorial for you guys. I promise that I'll be creating more tutorial, more content for you guys, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.